Hi guys. So on the agenda for today is a um, love spell type soap because Valentine's Day is coming up. So I decided let's embrace it. So I'm going to add in my lye water first. Gonna give it a good stir. Alrighty, looks like we are emulsified. So I'm going to separate this into two colors. I already have my color down here at the bottom of this one. So I'm just gonna separate it off. Okay, that's about half. And then I'm gonna mix in the color on this one. Alrighty, and so on this one we're gonna do white. So I got titanium dioxide, I'm just gonna add it in. Okay, so that's pretty white. So now I'm just gonna add in my fragrance. Then we mix this one. I'm just gonna add in the other half of the fragrance now. So that's pretty deep of a color. I think I wanna lighten up a little bit with the titanium dioxide. And I think we're ready to pour. Okay, and time to pour. So I'm just gonna start. Oops, 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 oops. On one side. Let's start on this side. And I'm just going to keep alternating between these two. Still pretty fluid, which is kind of what I wanted. You can't see. Okay, so that is pretty much it for the design on the inside. Okay, so I got a little bored and decided to texture the top. I just took like a um, skewer and then just did any kind, all kind, whatever I wanted designs. Um, got a little bit bored waiting for the frosting, so to speak, to be able to pipe. 
So I think it's about ready, so I'm going to go ahead and get started. But in my piping bag, I have dripped um, the micas, the same color as I used for this pink. I've dripped it down the piping bag just so that we're going to get kind of like a mix of the pink and the white as we're doing the piping. So let's get started. Okay, so I thought it was ready for piping, but it actually wasn't. So I think now it is. So we're going to go ahead and try and see what happens. So I'm just going to spray some rubbing alcohol. And now let's get to piping. I'm not sure if I like this. I feel like it's too matchy-matchy. Um, I feel like the piping is matching too much with the base. But, I don't know. I guess we'll just have to see what happens. It's still pretty liquidy, so I probably shouldn't be piping it yet. But I'm kind of impatient and it's taking forever. So, I guess we'll just have to wait a little bit after we pipe this first row just give it a little bit of time to harden up and then we can do the next layer first layer is done so I'm just going to give that a little bit of time to kind of just set up so that we can go ahead and pipe on the second layer. We wouldn't have to do this normally but I was just so impatient and that's totally why I'm now I have to wait some more. That's what happens when you're impatient. But anywho. So the top is done and I have a little bit more of the color here so I'm just going to drizzle a little bit more on top. I might want to put a little bit gold hmm. yeah let's do it let's just try and see what happens so this was totally last minute spur of the moment decision but I'm gonna go ahead and try add on some gold and um, see if that gives it a little bit of a pop
And hello, we had to relocate to a place with better lighting because this is actually taking so long to set up to be able to pipe that it's actually getting dark outside. So I had to come in here and there's better lighting in here. So hopefully you guys can see it a lot better than what you could see it when I was in my office or my soaping room. Anyway, so I do have the gold on there. You can see it a lot better now and then you have to see the pink as well. And now I'm going to go ahead and put some glitter. This is the Super Sparkles Makeup from Nurture Soap. Okay, and last step after glitter is to add in these embeds. I actually, these are painted with mica. So I'm just going to go ahead and stick them in. And then after that, we will be all set finally. So I'm going to stick them on this side. Okay, and we're all set. <clears throat> that is it for this loaf, thank goodness. Okay, and here she blows, guys. Here is the final loaf. And we will be back blah, blah, blah. We will be back tomorrow for the cut. I'll see you then. Hi guys, and we're back today for the cut. It's actually been two days because this one's still a little bit wet. But that's okay. I'm just going to cut off a small little sliver here on the end. There we go. There's the inside. some circles going on. Okay, and here are the final soaps. They're all looking a little bit different. There's no two that are exactly alike, which is cool. Um, I was hoping for a little bit more of a design like this one. So it's a little weird that like we got ones with like big circle eyes in the middle. But anyway, so that's it. They are all done and cut and ready to be cured. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comments below. And as always, if you want to see more, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and check out more of the videos we have coming. Thanks.